What's happening guys? Coach Chris Specht here for another edition, episode number three of 15 Minute Income. And we're going to uh, again jump into Jungle Scout and review some products. For you guys, we're going to find something within 15 minutes that will make you money. If you were to sell it on Amazon, if you were to private label it, brand it, ship it out to Amazon Direct, let Amazon do all the fulfillment, and you just keep supplying them product, then uh, you should be able to make some money. Let's get into it, guys. Okay, so let's jump right into the Jungle Scout web app. And uh, so last week we did an episode uh, where we spent uh, time looking through UK's um, Amazon site to see what would sell. And we quickly, within eight minutes, found a hot item. Um, we found headlamps that you could private label, custom label. Um, that you can buy for relatively cheap. We reached out to a couple of uh, the manufacturers who make the product in China, and we were able to see that we could probably get it around the $3 price point US, less obviously if you negotiate. And um, they're cheap to ship, um, and then the FBA on them was relatively decent as well. Uh, and they were priced at around $20 US. So the profit probably ranged anywhere from $6 to $10, just depending on how many reviews you built up. So that was an awesome product. We definitely said that was a home run. And in our books, home run is meeting the criteria, 300 sales per month minimum. Um, that, would, that particular product, the headlamp, had huge demand. First page to 15 um, listings, uh, demand was around 6,000 units a month. Second page, 15 listings, demand was around 2,000 per month for the headlamp. So, you know, if you work your listing and obviously if you get good photos, uh, good bullet points, um, good reviews, or great reviews, you could certainly turn that home run into a grand, a grand slam. I, I certainly believe that. All right, so we're going to jump and we're actually going to go into USA today. Now remember guys, I'm from Canada, but we're going to jump into the USA market. We're going to keep, keep our criteria the same, between $15 $50, estimate sales, minimum $300, 300 a month, and um, reviews, less than 100 reviews. So we're not changing anything, we just want to see standard size stuff. And um, let's get right into it. So I'm three minutes in, guys, but 15 minutes on the clock right now. And let's see what we can find in 15 minutes. Okay, so we have, as you can see right here, 4,979 um, listings. Now, let me quickly show you the difference between the U.S. market and the Canadian market. If I hit just a Canadian um, filter, same criteria, and I go down, I get 109 things to choose from. Some of you say, wow, that's great. You have an easier decision to make. Well, no. There are people in Canada looking too, so we have to change our settings completely in order to get more. Um, so often what guys do is they'll either um, lower this per month expectations, meaning they're not going to make as much. They'll either raise this, so they'll have to jump into a more competitive market, um, or they'll either raise this. Okay, Those are the three things that we have to change. But when you're in the U.S., I mean, 4,000, if you're struggling to find a product um, that is, is um, if you're struggling to find a product in the U.S., then you're, I mean, I'm going to find one in probably five minutes here. Um, it just, my whole thing is I look, is it unique? Well, flower and a rose, beauty and a beast. Is it lightweight? I go right into 
a weight district uh, change here. I always sync it with the the lightest first, okay? Because um, I want to ship that straight to Amazon and from Amazon straight to the customer. Um, so I'm not looking to to drop ship it at, at my house first. So we want to save on shipping. We want to be able to order a thousand or two thousand units at a good price, and the shipping only be five hundred bucks. Okay, so let's do the eye test. Supplements we're staying away from. Donald Trump we're staying away from. Okay, so we're here. What is this? A honey badger nectar collector. Selling 2,700 of these. Okay, for $18.99 US. The thing doesn't even weigh anything. <laughs> it's like shipping air. A honey badger nectar collector set. Very interesting. Very interesting. Well, let's take a peek. Honey Badger. Let's go Nectar Collector. Let's go with that. See what comes up. Nectar Collector sets. So we got we got one Nectar Collector, two Nectar Collector sets. It's a weird looking product. Nectar straws, nectar straws, nectar gun. <laughs> okay. So I don't really see much here. Let's see what we get out of the top two. Okay, let's just take a peek. 258. Doo -doo -doo. So we're looking for within the first 15 listings, we want to see around 2,000 sales minimum. Before we even bother, so I'm gonna jump right out of that one. You can keep searching. We got a white case, blue light, um, graduation caps, graduation photo booth props. That's graduation caps. Okay, graduation photo booth props. That's pretty niche. It's also pretty seasonal. All right. Cool. Scott White Blue Diamond handlebar, handlebar Hand Grips. Scott White being a brand name we won't want to compete with right now. Handlebar Grips. Body Lock. Handlebar Grips. Okay. We got Hand Guards. Fits Kawasaki's. Okay. Excellent quality black ink cartridge. Deep Wrangler. What's unique? Let's find something unique here. Okay, here we go. Memory cushion for the butt. It's like very light too. It's, how could it be that light? I thought these things were heavy. A tenth of a pound. Okay. All right. What's this? Filter caps. Office products, beauty and office products. Okay, let me do an audible here, guys. I'm going to change this down a little bit. I don't want beauty. Why is beauty up in? Okay, I don't want beauty. And office products are fine. Pet supplies, patio, kitchen. Let's make sure this home improvement, industrial, scientific. Okay, let's see where we're at now. Okay, 473. Let's see. We do this, get all the way in case that we eliminate 900. All right, what do we got here? Dials, we want dials, selfie sticks, we don't want that. Okay, what's this? Arm pad covers, some bizarre things that you see on here, guys. So I'll definitely give that. In, in Canada, we, we definitely don't see as much, but we, we, we see a lot of, you know, I'll be honest with you, I see a lot of good stuff. Here I'm seeing stuff that's just like completely bizarre. So we're not, we're, we're five minutes in here. So we got self-adherent uh, wrap tape. We looked at tape before. It was a, not a bad product, but we want to go for something a little bit better. 
So I'm gonna keep searching. Ta -ta 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 -ta. Philip jars. All right. What's this here? Lavender flower sack. Kitchen towel. Tea towel. Lavender flower sack towel in deep violet. Tea, ta tea towels. Okay, let's look at these. That's a neat looking product for sure. Amazon smile. Handmade. Let's not look at anything that's handmade. Glasses. I love the crunch. I'm trying to find something in 15 minutes. I love the crunch. Anvil. Okay, so we're gonna fly through this. We got eye tests. We're still looking here. I'm looking here. I'm looking here. I'm looking here. Tucker. Here we go. Filter spa. 357 of those. Lots of reviews on those though. You know, people are scared of reviews. I like reviews. I think reviews tell you your product is worth revealing. You know? Baby stuff. Mass. Da -da. Okay, we're getting in some good stuff here. We got a tip collar. A flea. Control collar tip. It's got some sales there. <coughs> Arva Flea and Tick Control Collar for Dogs and Puppies. Natural active ingredients, safe for babies. Okay. So we'll go Tick Control for Dogs. There we go. Control Collar. We want a collar. Tick Collar for Dogs. Collar dogs. Just tighten up these keywords a bit. Okay, there we go. So we got a few choices. Let's see what tick collars do for sales. You know, oh wow. So obviously, I mean, this first person is completely in control. Practically all the sales. So it's a branding Bayer. Pretty popular brand name. They sell the Soresto. You got quite a variance of brands. So this is a $51 version. Okay. So, I mean, sales are just through the roof. Like, that's well over 20,000 sales in the first page alone. Let's look at the second page and see how much we got in sales. So we'll look at the next. Let's extract some more numbers here. So we'll look at from 15 to 30. So 16 to 30, we still have, again, still plenty of sales. Let's go 31 to, still plenty of sales. You know, this is shampoos and stuff like that. Obviously, it's different. So we would definitely want to isolate what it is we're looking for. There's a tick collar there, you know. So the market is open. The market is definitely um, has demand. Essential oil, flea collar, different kinds of collars here. And, you know, it's going to take research. Obviously, you want to now eliminate um, a lot of these bad ratings like this person just getting terrible just getting chewed out 2.5 the quality sucks they're making 100 sales and you know then this person here has the shampoo tick shampoo so this is obviously a home run it's obviously going to um get you sales you know there's amazon merchant sellers fba everyone's linked in here the fba fees range at six dollars four dollars you know, so average sales a thousand. The average sale is a thousand. The average price is twenty nine bucks. 
So you, you could do a lot with this. This is something you could do a lot with, guys. Um, so tick collars. Tick collars for dogs. Okay. Now let's quickly jump over to... Um, jump over to Alibaba. Little tick collar for dogs. Let's see what Alibaba offers. And we want gold suppliers. Okay, and, and so here's a, here's a trick, guys. Once you've chosen your gold suppliers, go through just suppliers only. Do your search through gold suppliers under the supplier listing. That will eliminate your seeing duplicates. And um, so that helps. You know, you don't want to keep emailing the same person over and over. So that's one way I like it. Also, I love looking at this because, you know, it shows you how long they've been a gold supplier. It also shows you um, other features about the manufacturer. Let me see if I can get you some detail here. So we got how much total revenue they do. It's the big, bad company. All right. Okay. So, you know, there's, I mean, obviously, flea collars have been around forever, and it's an ultra competitive market, but there's sales to go around. Again, your listing has to be great. Your photos have to be great. There's got to be some action photos in there. You got to get reviews. You got to use things like Jump Send um, and start emailing your customers after every sale to get reviews. And um, pay per click. You got to get on your pay per click and you got to start advertising it. I'd probably do a fan page of some sort. Um, on Facebook, um, you know, fleeless dog or something like that, you know, itchy pets, start your own Facebook uh, fan page, start getting followers on there, promote your product on there, um, there's lots of ways you can do it, guys, but this one could include $3,000 a month, um, obviously, um, that's the goal. But you, if you work hard enough, you could certainly, there's no reason you couldn't rise to the first page, which, like I said, is at 20,000 sales, 1,000 sales um, on average on that first page per month. If you were to make you know, $5 profit minimum, um, you're making uh, 5000 If you were to make $10 profit minimum, you're making $10,000 a month off that one listing. So, again, we would reach out to any one of these listings here. Let's go look back and look at the price. What can we get these for? So we got $2.80 to $4.50. There's the Ceresto. So this is the one we've seen. This was the top dog. Okay, so the top dog, if you want to compete with top dog. Now, keep in mind, you definitely want to check, always check, is it patented? Now... Dog collars have been around for a long, long time. I don't feel like it would be patented, but do you want to go head to head with the top listing and just battle them on price? Probably not. They're probably buying a few thousand, three, four, five thousand, and they probably um, have a lot of margin to play with, more than you'll get from the suppliers on your first, um, first, uh, first uh, attempt at this product to sell okay so those are things you want to kind of keep in mind um, but it, why not there's no reason you can take 400 sales a month from this person okay there is exactly the same one and their brand is Bayer Soresto Bayer Soresto so let's Google let's Google Soresto see what Soresto is Soresto collar. Okay, Soresto.com. An innovative flea collar. Obviously, they own the brand. So you um, are looking to compete with that website right there. And they get a lot of their sales straight from this, this website, I'm sure. Okay, so... Let's go back over to it. Where is it? There's Soresto again. And that's Soresto here. Bear and Soresto. 
Okay, so that's all their products. Hearts. Dave's pool is selling Serestal. So Dave's pest defense is just, obviously, it's just an Amazon channel. Dave's pest defense. Let's see what else Dave sells. So Dave sells a few different things. All of which are random. Very, very random. But they're pest control items. Okay, so that's something you could think about. You could order a hundred and dip your feet and see what kind of sales you get just having a hundred inventory. Okay, so there you go, guys. We found a product in under 15 minutes that is definitely got a lot of demand and it's definitely certainly got competition. But when you look at it, the reviews are under a hundred. There are a lot lot of opportunities to in time get your reviews up and be certainly be socially competitive with any of these listings even if you're on a second or third page there's still sales reviews are even lower like this person unknown is a brand unknown they're still selling the same product okay so I would buy this product I wouldn't private label I'll just buy it under Soresto ship it straight to Amazon and just start selling selling the product that's what i would do absolutely i would probably buy a couple hundred if i could get them for three dollars and i could turn around and buy a couple hundred ship them straight to amazon buy it right away have it have it sent there get my listing going um there's no reason why you couldn't um you couldn't sell all 200 uh, and make some money again the prices are very competitive you know look at that there's lots of profit to be made there all right guys best of luck with that one if you like what you saw please make sure you subscribe right no right there And check out last week's listing right there, wherever it is. Doesn't matter, guys. Appreciate it. Make sure you subscribe. Love it. Thank you very much.